So my name is Sherry Thompson and I am the lab coordinator for New Horizons Crisis Center down here in central Utah. Um, I just wanted to talk a little bit about some of the challenges and the success now that the lab has passed through the legislature. Um, when I stepped into this role in July, I immediately started hearing wind that this was going to go to the Capitol. And I wanted to boogie and move fast to get law enforcement in our area on board, hoping it would be their own idea before we basically shoved it down their throat. I didn't want that to be our relationship with law enforcement. So I started getting busy and finding out who was using the lap and who wasn't. Um, some of our counties were, some were not. And I used some of my small town who I knew who owed me favors to get in and start asking if I could do some simple presentations to maybe show our law enforcement how this could be a great tool for them and a great opportunity for us to connect and work together. The Sheriff's Department was the first one to let me in and they were so wonderful and receptive. Um, I got in a couple more times and as I started getting out in the community and visiting with law enforcement and going to coalition meetings and explaining what the lap was, I started to feel um, the connection and the cooperation and had built a relationship with law enforcement before um, the lap was passed into law. Um, I think we've seen some great success with communication now. They understand kind of the shoes we wear and we also understand the shoes they wear. We went in with an attitude of what can we do to help you with this? Um, what can you teach us? And then they wanted to know more from us and it's just turned into more of a beautiful relationship. Um, I think if we go into it with that kind of attitude and work on our relationship with law enforcement that the lap will be more successful.